Just so, congratulations. A win on the famous Blackpool Winter Garden stage. How did it feel? Well, I feel great. It's the first time I play here. And the first win in the World Match play, so I can be my, more happy than this. Where does this particular tournament, Betfred World Match Play, feature for you? Is this one that you particularly watched on TV before you came over and started playing PDC regularly? Or? No, for me it's like another uh, tournament. Of course, all the tournaments, you know, they are important. Um, this tournament, uh, I start with a good fifth. <laughs> so, I'm happy to through to the second round. And second round, it's a little bit more complicated, but I'm here. Well, look, Gabriel Clemens, German number one, great player, but he caused you no problems at all to No, well, I, I expect more than uh, than this. He, have, he is a great player. He, I'm sure he can do better than, thi than this, this night. Uh, but this night, I think, if you can play your best game against me, you are lost. You, are lost. you come into this with enormous confidence, and rightly so. Some of the performances you put in have been incredible. Do you believe you're the best player in this tournament? Mm, no, no. Actually, I speak with my manager. Uh, before I go to the stage, I don't feel the grip of my dad. Uh, and then in the stage uh, I say to him, well, uh, since I like I, I, I go to the through to the bull who, who goes first, the things change. So I hope in the stage that the things change and my feeling with uh, my dad change too. And what's what I, that's what that's what happens. It's a unique venue. It's pretty hot, it's going to get hotter yeah, and we'll, right. yeah. we'll have a full house yeah. when you play next. Does that make it harder or easier or no difference? Uh, well, actually, you know, my shirt now it's a little bit more short. Yeah, uh, that, uh, except that's why um, I ask my shirt uh, a little bit short because before it's over here. Mm -hmm. And when you threw the dart, so the first dart, the, it just stayed there, mm -hmm. you know, uh, with my, my arm. Now it's moved with uh, the arm, um, the grip, you know, the temperature. So it's easier to play in the heat. No. What about the fans being there and the noise? Is that a factor for you? No, not at all. You know, uh, like I show to the people before in the Premier League. I played the semi-finals and the final with the crowd and I feel very, very calm with the crowd. Uh, I'm a different player than two years or three years ago. Yeah. Michael Smith, for you next, one of the few players who has beaten you more times yeah. than you've beaten him. Is, yeah. Do you f consider him a particularly difficult opponent? Well, every player is difficult. Uh, but Michael Smith is, is he have talent, so much talent. So, uh, well, if I if I, I can play my best game, maybe I'm, I'm sure I can beat him. But uh, we are two strong players, and we never know who who, who gonna win tomorrow, uh, next next round. Be fun finding out. Well done, Jason. Thank you. Jose, many congratulations. As you said to Dan, first time here at the Winter Gardens, did it take your breath away when you walked out there for the first time, just the venue and everything? Oh, thank you. Uh, well, um, can you repeat, sorry? So, first time here, when you went out there for the first time to look at the venue and play on the stage, mm -hmm. did it take your breath away because it's an iconic venue? No, uh, I just, well, for me it's a normal uh, tournament. Uh, I go over there, like, the other tournaments. Uh, since I I feel calm with the crowd, there's no problem with that. So for me, it was normal. You come here off the back of an amazing super series, yeah. some huge, huge averages. Are you looking to emulate what you do on the floor on the stage? And can you produce those big averages <laughs> in front of the fans? Well, I hope so. Uh, I still play better now uh, in front of the fans and. Um, 
I think I oh I show to everybody I can play with with crowd. Uh, I have so much fans now with me and people who likes my my game and yeah. Um, maybe can I, I make some average, big average in front of the crowd? It was, if I can do that, it was uh, wonderful for everybody. I know you've been playing it, Dan, saying you're not the best player no. here, but your stats would suggest you are. The big averages, winning tournaments after tournament. Inside, are you secretly thinking, I can win this? Uh, well, uh, usually I go step by step. Uh, I never think. Well, if I can get the semi-final and then the final and then no, uh, I I like to go step by step, little by little, slowly. Uh, think in the next game if I win in the next game, and uh, I think that's the best way I can work with um, uh, you know. Uh, it's these players they are so difficult to beat. Uh, so you can think about that if I go win or not you have to think in the next player yeah, and that's that's how I work that's thank you very much as always welcome. Jose you came into this event as one of the favourites a lot of people were talking about you how, how does that feel? well I feel great uh, finally the people speak about me <laughs> I think it's a great thing but uh, I think it was oh, they speak about the things I do because now I'm one one of the, the best players in the world in this moment I don't feel that way because I work so much to make um, better things uh, play better my game uh, you know I, I'm really happy to know that we know you had that amazing Grand Slam win but do you feel the Premier League has taken your game to a next level playing the best players over 17 nights yes of course absolutely uh, Premier League is the 10 best players of the world over there. May make the final, it's amazing for uh, everybody, e every player. Uh, I mean, uh, every game it's a final over there in the Premier League. So, uh, make the final for me, it's a dream come true. And uh, the field, my work, uh, all my work results in the good things, in the good results. Um, so, I'm really happy with all the things I do right now. Thanks, Jose. Thank you. You're welcome. Jose, the Grand Slam um, knockout format is quite similar to what we've got this week at the World Match Play. Do you think these longer formats are suited to your game? No, uh, I mean, I always, my mentally, mentality, it's always the same. And if I have a one month stop, I work in my house myself. Uh, if I have uh, other tournaments, whatever, uh, I go with always the, the same mentality. So um, you know, it doesn't be a, a problem for me. Yeah.